Oh, welcome to our new apartment in Kuret, guys. My name is Exodus Bjerling. He's my father, Bjerling Kasa. Here, that's my mother, Esther Hailey. This is my little sister, Devora Bjerling, and Bersabi Bjerling. Outside, that's my brother, Iyasu Bjerling. The Bialin family has just spent their very first night in the Holy Land, and not just anywhere, in this brand new five-room apartment located in a new neighborhood of the city of Kiryat Gat in southern Israel, an apartment that will be theirs for the next two years. We don't expect such kind of uh, uh, luxurious life, of course. It's really a turning point for my family. After having waited many years before being able to immigrate, Bialin Kasa is today at 56 years old, a happy father and husband. 15 years ago, my father and eight brothers and sisters uh, came to Israel. At that time, I was uh, I, I married uh, Esther, and she was conceived uh, my first child, Exodus. From that time, I was just dreaming day and night to come to uh, Israel. The Bialians were chosen along with two other Ethiopian families to be part of a pilot project by the Jewish Agency and the UGA Federation of New York in Israel. For the first time, families from Ethiopia are being settled directly in apartments and not in absorption centers. We offer the new, a new model within the community with better uh, Rakhlan services and most importantly with higher chances to have eventually a better integration process within the society. Private market apartments have been rented and we have chosen solid families. An absorption center could have slowed their integration. Like all the new immigrants from Ethiopia, these three families will still be able to count on the Kiryat Gat Absorption Center and its services to take their first steps in Israel. Being a new immigrant to Israel remains a significant challenge. With the new immigrants pass through an absorption center like this, or are directly integrated into the community through private accommodation, the goal is that they successfully integrate. Their success is our success as a society. At 17, Exodus, the eldest daughter of the Bialin family, had never known anything other than Gondar, her native city located in a rural region in northern Ethiopia. In Gondar, if you are a great person, you have education, you have a great mind, but you have no such thing to success. Life is too hard there. I think the future will be great. This week, 170 new Ethiopian immigrants arrived in Israel. According to the Jewish Agency, there are still a few thousand people in Ethiopia hoping to be able to reach the Holy Land as soon as possible.